guys, it's LaJonna. Just wanted to check in real quick for this week on my P3. Um, today is P3 day five for me, and um, it's been a little funny. Um, those of you who are my friend on uh, my fitness pal um, uh, probably saw my post this morning. Um, this, it, these, I've always heard that the, every round is different. But my P3s have mostly been, you know, pretty predictable, pretty much the same every time, or not really the same every time. But I mean, as far as weight fluctuations, all that good stuff, I usually stabilize immediately, good to go, all that good stuff. This round has been really strange, though. Um, in the two days after my last injection, of course, you know, we continue to lose. Well, I lost down to my, my LIW was uh, 120.8. And during those two days after, or actually the day after that, I dropped down to 119.4. And then the next day I was 119.4. Again, of course, you know, and you know you're not gonna stay at that, so that's, you know, not even an option, but basically, but anyway, nonetheless, um, the next day, day three, uh, or actually day one, after I weighed on day two, of course, uh, for my day one, I gained 1.4. The next day I gained 1.4 and it's been really funny because now for the last three days in a row I'm dropping 0.2 every day just it's just funny uh, it's amazing I was kind of worried and thought okay prepared myself mentally to do my correction day if I needed to um, after those couple of gains thinking the next day was going to be a, you know a correction day but it's just been it's just been funny uh, so for those of you newbies out there um, that are going to be doing several rounds it, it no two rounds are exactly the same just period so just get ready for that and uh, pre prepare yourself mentally to know that that just um, is the way it is um actually today um again this morning i dropped 0.2 and i am 121.8 which is exactly 0.8 over my ldw not bad uh, with me be still being in my first week of p3 um Fluctuations are usually, you know, pretty drastic or whatever. This one, you know, we've got a little steady loss thing going on here, and I hope that continues and gets me back down to my LDW. Um, starting to feel better, getting enough energy now to uh, maybe start working out hopefully next week some. Um, I'm not a big... Uh, uh, I'm not a, a big fan of drastic amounts of exercise because I don't want to, you know, create a level of exercise that my body cannot maintain because I am not super dedicated to exercising. So I don't ever want to get to a point to where uh, I'm doing so much exercise that if I lay off of it or don't do it every day or whatever, that my body starts gaining weight because it's used to having that exercise. So I'm going to do moderation. Um, going kind of by Mark Sisson with the uh, off Mark's Daily Apple, um, his whole thought process about uh, um, ancestral health and, and doing uh, um, short bursts of exercise and, and some weightlifting things like that. So I'll hopefully get to start you know some of that back up next week. Um, feeling good today. Um, another thing I'm trying to do on this round is follow hunger. Um, that's been interesting because I catch myself, you know, having those times where I'm not following hunger. I'm just kind of eating because it's dinner time or whatever, but I'm catching myself and I'm really starting to regulate that. And it's really, really interesting and insightful um, how some of the things have come about. Like um, last round on my P3, I ate um, three eggs and five pieces of bacon every morning for breakfast. Usually wasn't hungry till like one or two o'clock for lunch and just eat something small and then I would eat a halfway good sized dinner. Um, following the hunger, I'm noticing that like, um, like this morning, all I've had is my coffee with a little bit of cream in it and a piece of bacon. And I've got kind of my little lunch thing here that's got my little boiled eggs in it and my bacon and my, and my cheese because that's uh, the last couple of days, just about all I've eaten. And for lunch and breakfast, I'll eat, you know, like an egg and a piece of bacon around 10 o'clock, which I think is about that time now, yeah. And then I'm starting to get hungry. So that's what I'm gonna eat for my breakfast probably. I'll start out with an egg and a piece of bacon, and then like around 1.30, 
yesterday I ate another egg and a couple of pieces of bacon and um, a uh, string cheese and then I was good to go until like around three and I had some a handful of mac nuts like eight of those uh, mac nut pieces you know they're not holes usually they're at like halves of mac nuts roasted mac nuts and then uh, for you know then I'm not hungry for dinner until around you know six o'clock or so so it's just uh, it's been really insightful and interesting to kind of try to follow the hunger thing and uh, see how it works for me we'll see uh, I'll keep you guys quick posted on how that how that's going what's the funniest loading video I've ever seen the other day um, it's Boston Lynn uh, Lynn CC 01 is her YouTube channel uh, just it was hilarious she had music playing in the background and she had taken suggestions from uh, lots of people on uh, YouTube about what they craved so then that's what she loaded on and it was just very comical she did fast forwards it was just it was funny hilarious best loading video I've ever seen i um, also wanted to mention give a shout out to Jess Wonder um, uh, Jessica is uh, back uh, starting her her round and uh, she's doing she's doing good and also uh, Kathy tasting thin um, is is uh, on another round and she's doing real good too and I just want to give shout outs to those guys and wish them big giant releases and uh, hope that they're doing good also um, gosh I can't ever think of her name but it's uh, just granny I think Just granny something, and I'll I'll edit maybe if I have time today to, to edit. Maybe I'll edit put her her full name on there, and I can never remember her first name for some reason. I do not know what my problem is with that, but I think maybe it's Becky. Anyway, I don't want to mess that up, so I'll end up, I'll I'll edit and uh, make sure I put her name in there. But uh, she is about to go into uh, P3. She has um, had some issues this round with, uh, I guess, just kind of keeping her head in the game, maybe, because I know how that is. If, you, if your head is not wrapped around this, you are in for a doozy of a round. And she's done so great about keeping a positive attitude and, you know, recognizing, you know, what's going on with her and, and uh, just going ahead and ending this round, getting it out of the way. Uh, getting into P3 and then um, we'll mentally prepare yourself to do you know probably another round so I just uh, hats off to you girl um, very smart smart decision uh, super proud of you and I wish you the best on P3 enjoy that P3 food and I think that's it for me this has been kind of a rambling vlog but I've been trying to do it I've been making notes for three days and just haven't had time to stop so I made myself stop today because I promised myself I'm going to give weekly updates on P3 so oh also uh, my um can't think of her first I can't think of her YouTube channel but uh those of you who have been vlogging for a while you probably know my um, and she gave an update hasn't given one in a long time and uh, she looks fantastic and um, just just doing wonderful I don't know if uh, she said something about that she gained a little bit of weight back but that uh, she didn't think that she was going to do HCG but she wasn't sure she may go another route uh, to try to to try to get that uh, extra weight off but those of you who know her um, you should go and uh, uh, check out her her vlog from yesterday anyway that's it for me um, I love you guys and I hope you have a great weekend um, Blake was supposed to race this weekend up in the Dallas area, but he's not going to now because they rained it out. So, um, hopefully I'll have a, a relaxing weekend myself. <laughs> I love you guys. We'll see y'all next week. I'll update you. I don't know what day, but it'll be sometime next week. Love you guys. Bye.